Assalamu alaikum dear student hope you are fine and doing well by the grace of almighty allah welcome to NIEVS home school i am nasim akhtar assistant teacher of science national ideal english version school morning shift dear student today i am going to take a science class for class 7 student dear student our today's topic is assignment 2 science assignment 2 and this is fourth week assignment let us see today's topic our today's topic is science assignment 2 and this is part 1 and this is lecture number 36 this is lecture number 36 so dear student let us start today's class you can see this is our assignment topic and this is question and the topic is this is based on chapter 6 structure of matter particles of atom atom and molecule smallest particle theory molecule and formula use of water as universal solvent this is the topic and the question is here lithium water table salt that means regular salt that we use uh, for our cooking and this one chalk carbon lime nitrogen potassium oxygen iodine iron chlorine etc are some matters a number question is what is element what is element and B number question is write the differences between molecule and atom write the differences between molecule and atom and C number question here is separate elements and compound from matters mentioned in the stem by using symbol or and formula separate elements and compound from matters mentioned in the stem by using symbol and formula and d number question is which matter is called universal solvent among matters mentioned in the stem analyze the reasons which matter is called universal solvent among matters mentioned in the stem analyze the reasons and here is only one short question and this, this short question is why is sugar called compound why is sugar called compound dear student today we will discuss a number b number and c number question answers i i have um, i will show you uh, just uh, the um, what will you uh, write just i will give you clue and uh, you have to write by yourself don't uh, copy from here and the first one is a number what is element what is element in your book if you open uh, page number 61 61 page you can find here is the answer of element this is 61 number page the answer is here the matter that are made of only one component the matter that are made of only one component is called element like for example iron copper oxygen hydrogen that means if we break element then we will find only one kind of component this is called element this is called element so a number question answer is done now b number write the differences between molecule and atom write the differences between molecule and atom i have written here uh, answer write the differences between molecule and atom b number answer here is differences between molecule and atom are given below for answering this uh, question you can make 
a differentiate table here and you can write uh, with point 1 number, 2 number or 3 number. But I am here write uh, separately molecule and atom and molecule is smallest particle of element and compound is called molecule. Smallest particle of element and compound is called molecule. Molecule can stay free or independent. Molecule can stay free or independent. The number of molecule is unlimited in the universe. Molecule cannot take part directly in the chemical reaction. Molecule cannot take part directly in the chemical reaction. And here is atom. Atom is the smallest particle of an element. Atoms cannot stay free or independent. Atoms cannot stay free or independent. The number of atoms is limited because the atom is the smallest, smallest particle of an element. So, elements are limited that is why the number of atoms is limited. Atom can take part directly in the chemical reaction and atoms can take part directly in the chemical reaction. I have written here four lines in molecule section and four lines uh, in atom section and you can make a differentiate table and you can make four points molecule and four points atom here. And now C number. C number question is separate elements and compound from matters mentioned in the stem by using symbol and formula. We can see here uh, in the question here is some um, elements, some matters, some of them uh, is elements and some of them are compound. We have to separate them uh, with symbol and formula. I have written here some um, answers. C number separate elements and compound from matters mentioned in the stem by using symbol and formula. Answer is according to the question elements and compound are separate below. You can make a table like this then you will write one number is lithium. Lithium is element. Then you can write the next table is it will element then you will write element here and it uh, is uh, the matter will be compound then you will uh, write compound here. And the symbol of lithium is Li and uh, here is no formula of lithium. And then water, water is compound because if we break water we can find uh, more than one elements that is why water is compound and there is no symbol of water and formula of water is H2O and three number is salt. I do not uh, I did not read it here um, the answer uh, you know salt is also a compound then you will write here compound and uh, this uh, salt is a uh, no symbol and uh, the formula of salt is NaCl that means sodium chloride and you will find this answer in your book. Four number is chalk, four number is chalk and this is also a compound and the, because this is a compound that is why it does not have a symbol and their formula of chalk is calcium carbonate. CaCO3, CaCO3. Then the five number is carbon. I did not write here uh, the answer. Uh, you know carbon is element also and the symbol of carbon is C and there is no formula here. And six number is lime. Lime is a one kind of compound. And here is no symbol and the formula of lime is CaO, calcium oxide. And then seven number, seven number is nitrogen. 
nitrogen is also an element and the symbol of nitrogen is n and the formula is n2 and potassium potassium i didn't write here the answer you will find this answer in your book you have to do it by yourself i have shown you that how will you write this answer and nine number is oxygen you will write this answer also and 10 number is iodide iodide that means this one is iodine this is also an element and the symbol of this um, iodine is i and the um, next one is iron i didn't write here the answer you will find iron uh, symbol in your book next uh, 12th number is chlorine chlorine this is also element and the symbol of uh, chlorine is cl so dear student i hope you have understood now how will you write this questions answers i hope you will do your assignment two number assignment properly and the submission date of your assignment is 29 11 20 this is your submission date of your assignment the, your submission date of assignment is 29 11 2 29 11 2 this is the submission date of your assignment 2 So dear student, I hope you have understood today's topic and do your assignment properly and submit your assignment uh, in due date that means 29, 11, 20 day. So dear students, stay home and we will see you again in our next class. Till then, Assalamu Alaikum. Thank you.